All right, so we've called it Museum Road, but it's called Graham Parkway. Coming up to Mill Hill Test Center. Now these little two roundabouts that we can come across now, I'm gonna call them the Mill Hill Minis. These two roundabouts are generally quite busy during the daytime. And I've had a student, a few students nearly hit this curb that you're gonna be coming across. I'll tell you what I mean. We're gonna go left first exit. Left first exit. Yep. And uh, you're gonna get two lanes of approach here. So we're gonna slow it down. Try not to accelerate it so as it's not gonna help you. And that's your issue giving way to your right. So I've had the students get too distracted with the right hand side, not focusing on that curb right yeah, there and then hitting that curb, yeah? That's the test centre right there, looking at that building in that corner. I see. That's where it is. And technically, for us to go into the test centre, we will take it, we're not going to go in. You'll signal right and you go in to the arrow on the right. Can you see it in the middle? Yes. And it's through the barriers on the right. Okay. This is the second round roundabout that I call the Millwood Minis. Generally quite busy. I'm going to go straight on. Fairly good at the moment. It's quite... Quite quiet. Cool stuff. Now, keep on going. Once we get to the end of the road, we're going to be turning left. It used to be a give way down here, but it's become a stop sign and a stop line. turning left at the end of it. Okay. The road that you're going to go into, we're going to call it uh, Colourful Road. I'll tell you why in a second. Okay. It is a stop sign, so there's no point looking. You need to stop regardless. Okay. So you've got to stop regardless if it's clear or not. You've got to stop. And you might be even encouraged to get the hammery on while it's waiting. There's a zebra crossing there after that students get distracted with yeah. because they don't see it. Because they're sort of worried about it going in good time. So there's a, there's a shop called Design Colours, can you see on the right yeah. side? We're going to call this road Colourful Road. Now why I call it Colourful Road is it's a windy road, bendy road. I've had students unfortunately nearly hit parked cars on the test because yeah. there's buses coming towards them yeah. and they end up getting too close and the examiner moves, moves their steering wheel. Yeah. Yeah? It's happened off sort of both directions. This road changes from 30 to 20 to 30 as there's a school coming okay. up. Um, this road leads up to the infamous double mini roundabout. This double mini roundabout, students unfortunately sometimes struggle with it because it's quite fast paced. Yep. Okay. So currently on colourful road. <coughs> As you can see, it's 20. Anytime there's a change of speed limits, you check your relevant mirror, centre mirror right to evaluate what's behind you. <coughs> Excuse me, I'm um, sort of overtaking you. Anytime there's a change of speed, sometimes like, oh, change of speed, let's take this learner. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. A bit closer to that bus there, Dandy. Yeah. Maybe you could just slow it down a bit more. And again, look, it's gone down yeah. to 30 again. So your infamous double mini roundabout's coming up. We're going to go towards Burnt Oak. I want you to tell me how you get to Burnt Oak just before you attempt to do it. <coughs> How do you do it? Um, it's a separate e Left, yep. and then left again. Good, left and left. First exit, first exit. Good, first exit, first exit. So, relevant mirror signal left. This is where the whole concept of timing your shield, if you have one, yep. it's ending that shield though. Yep. If you're committed, you're committed, mate. Keep left, keep left now. And then look over to your, look over again. You've got to be nice. Signal again though. Look, just don't look, don't just look right, look for the shield as well, yep. yeah? Cool. Should go back and do that again, yeah, one more time, yeah? Sure. But fairly easy, right? Yeah. yeah not, 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 not difficult at all. Let's, let's, let's take the second left. Sure. <coughs> A lot of the side roads are sort of pretty much meeting type of roads. Cool. So you've got to be conscious about meeting other vehicles, especially when it gets tight with the parked cars and stuff. Reflections may help, but it is rainy, so it's difficult to see that. Yeah. Next left again. 
is 20, so just be conscious. Yep. Speed limits usually just start sort of when you enter a new road, so I don't know if you saw that or not, yeah? Do you see the speed limit here? There's a 30. Yeah, cool. Right, this road here, they can get you to do manoeuvres, like parallel parking, as you can see the other load are doing it. Potential emergency stop, pull up, pulling up on the right hand side of the road. Back in the day when they were doing reversing around the corner to the left, for Mill Hill and Hendon, they used to sort of use this corner coming up where the okay. blue car is now. Yep. Uh, obviously, we're not, we're not doing such manoeuvres, but this will be a, a famous corner okay. that they would use. And also, the next corner coming up would also be a potential corner that they would use. If you're going to go around him, you've got to check your mirrors for yep. Domino's Pizza Man, yeah? Otherwise, Domino's might have just sort of get stuck in between you and the silver car that's parked. Uh, right, coming up to the giveaway, we're going to be turning left onto Colourful Road again. Okay. Yeah? <coughs> and we're going to go Burnt Oak. Which way was Burnt Oak from what you remember? Uh, first exit, first exit. Yeah, left and left, yeah? First exit. And then first exit. <coughs> <coughs> Excuse me. So there's no defined lane or lanes on approach to this entrance, mm -hmm. but naturally you want to sort of keep to the left hand side, yeah? Make a decision before you commit to stopping. Yeah. Once you're on, you're in, you're queen, you're the king of the roundabout, get going. It's alright, it's alright, take yep. your time, it's alright. Oh, don't rush it, don't rush it, don't rush it, don't rush it. Because you decided to stop, you know, just fine, yep. you stopped. Back to, you know, you're already in one anyway, but just take your time, yeah. yeah? Alright, cool. We'll go back to that roundabout. We'll do a different exit this time though, yeah? Take the next left again for me, Andy. So far, um, how are you finding the area? I know we haven't seen much of it, but so far. Um, doable. It's different. Yeah? What do you find that's different? Um, <clears throat> the roads are much less straightforward. Okay. So they're a lot more nuanced, a lot more um, twists and turns. Yeah. Ne ne next left. Um, yeah, it's a lot more suburban yeah. to what we're used to, isn't yeah, it? Yeah. Good. It's a lot more suburban. Road quality is also much shit. Uh, yeah, certain roads, isn't yeah. it? Yeah, we had really bad roads, yeah? I'll tell you why, that road there, there was a lot of construction happening on that oh, road. So because of that, that particular road has always been a little bit rubbish yep. because of that sort of construction. That's fine, exactly. That Jane before the move over, yeah? Yeah. So that just move over. If you need to move over, just check out for Jane first. All right, and then actually obviously you can look out for your dominoes before you go. Right, so when we get to the end of the road, we're going to turn left, but this time we're going to go to Mill Hill. Which way do you think Mill Hill might have been in the diagram? Uh, was it second exit? Well, let's start with the first roundabout. Okay, uh, it would have been first exit. First exit, and then the second roundabout? If it's going back north, then second exit. So good, basically left and right. Yeah. Okay. Yeah? Left and right. So we've got it in our mind already. Yep. But we'll get that clarity when we see the sign again. Sure. This road that you're emerging into, right now it's fairly okay, it's fairly quiet. Can get busy though during the daytime. Yep. You would in the daytime make sure that you when you pull out you don't get anyone to slow down, stop or change direction. Yep. Clarity was it is 
first exit, then second exit, is that correct? Uh, to Edra, yes. Yeah, so it's left and right, yeah? yeah? Now here, don't keep to the left, because what I find is a lot of people try to overtake it. So at least hug right. the middle. Be a bit selfish and hug the whole yeah, middle. Yeah. Just like that. Because I find that if you keep left, some of the vehicles overtake you to turn the same direction. Yep. Does that make sense? Yeah, yeah, I've seen it. So relevant mirrors, signal, take your time, and then think about what you're doing. Straight into the right lane, and then think about what signal you're going to give now. Make a decision. Job done, mate. That's it. Fairly simple enough, yep. yeah? Cool stuff. Don't need to signal to come off. I okay. guess it's a mini roundabout, yeah? Oh, I see. They're both minis, yeah? Uh, okay. The double mini roundabouts. Take the next right coming up. Slow it down, take your time. Put yourself in that filter turn space, which is in the middle. So you can okay. put yourself in that middle space. Is it? Off yeah, this? That, yeah, this, this one, this one. No. one yeah. The signal died there, yeah, yeah. yeah. Just make sure it stays on. Nice new road. Again, road suitable for like maybe parallel parking, parking yep. on the right. Uh, potential emergency stop, maybe, yeah. Obviously, it's Sunday, so a lot, a lot more parked cars so mm -hmm. become a medium type of road. It isn't actually a medium type of road anyway. Mm -hmm. <coughs> At the end of the road, we're going to turn left when we get closer. Find loads of driving schools nearby, yeah. isn't it? Loads. Yeah. yeah. They're all either live in the area or practicing the area because, of, like, we're doing it now. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Bit aggressive guy. What you need to do, yeah? You can see how he's intimidating, yeah? yeah. Naturally, as you see that, yeah, he's doing that int intentionally, yeah, yeah. purposely to force you to move over. Right. But your examiner's getting nervous. Yeah. Yeah. Because you're not you're not acting accordingly earlier enough okay so you're leaving it a little bit late yeah obviously i can trust you because i'm your instructor to an yeah. extent yeah but i needed you to slow down more yeah. earlier and pulled in earlier okay yeah rather than leaving it all last minute slightly being hopeful that you're not going to be you're going to be okay <laughs> does that make sense yeah? Yeah, yeah don't be hopeful that's the wrong thing to feel i didn't want to turn left We never want to hope that we're not going to hit that curb or hit that car. Does that yeah. make sense? Yeah? yeah. We want to be more sure. Right, we're going to go Mill Hill, Andy. Okay. Mill Hill. Have a look, see, tell me. Um, first and second exit. Exactly the mirror image of what we just did, yeah? Yep. they're going into the gas station so don't follow the timing of their signals good mirror checks there cool well done straight into the right the best you can because okay. you're sort of crossing over there yeah, does that yeah. make sense yeah so it's like your lane has been slightly there, yeah? Or just get a better position straight straight on. Couple of shoes there. Time them. Once you're on the roundabout, remember you're the king of the roundabout, yeah? yeah? I can see that you're a bit reluctant to turn there because you're worried about that silver car, yeah? If you show a little bit more assertiveness without being aggressive, yeah. but one, it's your right way, two, yeah. if you show reluctancy, he's going to think, right, let yeah. me just go, yeah? The learner's yeah, yeah. sort of taking time and it delayed your turn as well, yeah? yeah. Think about what you're seeing. Next right. This one coming up. Mm -hmm. Yep, don't rush it though. Yep. Cool stuff. Take the next left. Make sure 
that signal stays on, Andy. Once you get to give way, you're going to turn left. Back onto Colourful Road. Okay. It's a bit of an uphill, slopey one, yeah? Yeah. <coughs> you are kind of slightly protruding, yeah. Though, yeah? So you don't want to be here for too long. Good, that acceleration helped a lot, yeah. man. Yeah? Felt it. Good, well done. Right, Tot Ridge. Tot Ridge. Mm -hmm. Second exit, yeah. We don't need to think about the, the, the other roundabout. Okay. It's, all, it's only relative just for this one roundabout. Yep. It's just right second exit. If you time it well. Yeah. Good. You see how the shoes are really yep. coming into play around here, yeah? And again, you don't need to see yeah. to come out, yeah? So in Labra Grove, fine, we get to see it, but because yep. it's so quick, sometimes we don't have the opportunity, but now, it really sort of comes into play now a yeah. little bit more, isn't it? Yeah, absolutely. All right, now look, I'm not going to do left first exit, it's too easy. Okay. okay? But you're coming up to an infamous roundabout, it's okay. called the Apex Corner. This entrance is the infamous entrance to Apex Corner. Yeah? What I'd like us to start with is right third exit towards Central London, Brent Cross. Okay. And the other one says Mill Hill. Now, we want to go right third exit. There's three lanes. What lane would you naturally pick? Um, uh, right. Right, yeah, lane. good. Middle or right? Let's go right because we know it's right. Okay. So slow it down. I want you to do the appropriate mirrors and signal. Yeah. And get into the lane that says A1S and TOTT. Can you see? Yep. Yeah. That means that this lane splits into two. We want A1S. Okay. A1S means south. Okay. Now, before you enter, have a look where the A1S says A1S. Are we good to go? Um, Can we go now? Yeah. Cool. Gas, 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 mate. Come on, you're on. A1S. Now, don't accept no more. A1S? Uh, middle lane. Third, uh, third fine, lane. fine, 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 fine. You're going the wrong. It's okay. Try to change lane safely. Okay. Take your rears. Right. Don't rush it. Don't rush it. Stay in your lane. Okay. And signal left to come off. Stay where you are. Signal left to come off. Signal left. Yeah. Because you've gone past okay, exit yeah, two. Yeah. This is your third exit. Now, stop here. We're going to work with the guy on our left. We're going to call him Larry, yeah? Okay. We need to work together to exit the same exit. So yep. keep it going. Work with the other Larry. Work yep. together. You're good. Cancel. You're good. Pick up speed. It's 50 miles an hour, yeah? Okay. You're getting overtaken by Barry on your right hand yeah, side, yeah. yeah? Hard gas, mate. Try and move into your normal drive lane in good time, yeah? Cool. Well done. You recovered. Cancel. Okay. So technically, you went into the Totridge lane, which yeah. you didn't want. But you safely moved over, yeah? Okay. Change your gears to full force. Skip again. Good. Hard gas, mate. I need you to change lanes to the right lane. I'll tell you why in a second. Okay. Right, we're going to go towards Mill Hill Broadway. Cancel signal. Get your lane properly. Have a look at the sign. Can you see what exit it was? Uh, third. Good. So, we're going to go right third exit. Right third exit. Think about mirrors and signal. Get out of the way from about now ish because we're traveling fast. Yeah. What gear do you approach roundabouts in? Uh, second lane. There's three lanes. What lane will you naturally approach in? Um, furthest right. Don't. Good, but don't. Okay. Middle lane. Middle lane. Okay. Break, 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 break. Better gear. Middle lane, yeah? Yep. Smooth off. I'll tell you why in the middle lane in a second. Don't accelerate. You've got lots of momentum. Yeah. Break. Count, count. One. One. Don't accelerate. Don't accelerate. Two. Stay in the middle lane. Stay in the middle lane. Yep. Two. Stay Two. in the middle lane. Yep. Mirrors and signal left to come off. You're working with Larry. Okay. But Barry, unfortunately, is also coming off. Can you see? Yeah, I see. Barry it. shouldn't be uh, exiting here. Larry's cool. So we work with Larry. Yeah. Barry's being a bit cheeky, yeah? We've got to work with both, yeah? But ideally, it's, it's Larry's the first most appropriate guy. Have the priority, yeah. then it's us, yeah? Okay. So let's work together. Be conscious of the other Larry as well. Okay, the other Barry is actually not exiting, yeah? Yeah. Cool. 
Mill Hill Broadway, mate, yeah? Slow it down a little bit. You see how it's a red light, yeah? Yeah. We can actually go stop at the solid white line. But the car behind you shouldn't stop behind us. Okay. So get to your solid white line, mate. Can you see the solid white line? Uh, right under the light. Yeah, well, it's gone. Yeah, it's gone, I see, I see yeah, it's it gone now, yeah. anyway. I see it now, yeah. Bus, be concerned. Yeah. Let the bus go. Oh. Mill Hill Broadway. Not like Harrow Road, but yeah. busy nonetheless. Yeah, yeah. People opening doors, people pulling off. <coughs> okay, people walking between cars. Cars parking, cars doing some weirdness, just sort of sin indicating sitting there. Mm -hmm. Maybe there's someone jumping in the car so they want to take that space. Mm -hmm. Traffic lights. Now we're coming up to a roundabout that I call Marks and Spencer Mini. MS Mini, yeah? Cool. Now this mini roundabout, I've had students fail for it because they've swung into the adjacent lane when turning. Okay. So what we're gonna do is obviously focus on what you're doing now, anticipate your lights. A bit downhill, so you don't have to really accelerate too much now. Yeah. You're already committed for the amber. Yeah, yeah. Keep to the right lane. We're gonna go turn right. Lane. Yeah, there's MLS. Can you see the MLS on the right? Yeah, I see it. So you're gonna turn right. So mirrors the signal right. Don't accelerate because it's not gonna help you. We wanna go around the roundabout best you can without swinging left. Don't swing left. Okay. Look over to your right. Are we good? Should we go? You can do yeah. it. Yeah, that's it. Don't go on the roundabout. That's it. Good. Well done. You didn't swing at all. What I've had is students swing. Thinking I've got to go around it a bit more. Right, okay. Yeah. And then boom, there's a car on the left hand side, the examiner stops them from moving yeah. over. Or the car next to you gives a big beep. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Design colours. What road are we on? Colourful road. Good. Right, what roundabouts are coming up? Uh double roundabout. Yeah, double mini, yeah. You see how we're picking up local knowledge yeah, now, yeah? So it's, it's, it's that repeat of things, yeah? Yeah. Now I'm gonna go back to the Apex corner and try to do to do that again, yeah? Okay. What's the speed limit at the moment? 20. Good. Your sat nav says 30. That's why you take your sat nav with a pinch of salt. Yeah. Right. So we're going to go towards Top Ridge again. Top Ridge, yeah. Your wipers. Reduce it to the lowest intermittency level. Anti-clockwise to the bottom. Anti-clockwise. There you go. Right now, focus on your top ridge. Okay. And your back wiper, you can turn it off as well. Yeah. It's the other way. Send it. Send it. Send it. Handbrakes can always be a good platform. Yeah. Good. Don't be afraid of the accelerator, man. It's gonna help you. It's gonna help you. Cool. You're the king, mate. Signal. Make sure the signal stays on, yeah? You'd have to signal to come off. Don't worry, let it cancel itself. If yep. it doesn't, you can fiddle with it. It will cancel as long as you straighten your wheel up. Yeah. Just take you, excuse me. Got a cold and a hay fever. Yes. <laughs> And a chesty cough, it's like some madness. <laughs> Alright, so right, it's gonna be right third exit Mill Hill. Do you remember what label it was in? Right third exit, um, furthest right. Yeah, and what did it say on the floor? Uh, A1S. A1S, yeah? A1S. S for sugar, which actually means south, yeah? A1S, sugar, south, yeah. A1S is south, yeah? Yeah. I'm just saying sugar because yeah, yeah, yeah. just to simplify that. S means south. So we're going towards Mill Hill. Exactly. South. Right now, take your time. Think about what you're doing. Think about what your MSM routine. Okay. So it's going to be mirrors, then the signal, do the signal, then the maneuver, which is gears, yep. gears, approach it appropriate. You're in the appropriate lane. Yep. Okay. Make a decision as you approach. Don't hit the, the curb. No, 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 no. Cut fast, excuse me, yeah? Both of them you would have affected, yeah? 100, yeah? You look like you was going into that lane, yeah. Oh, fine. Like the other car as well, yeah? yeah Take your time. Are we good? Yeah. Be prompt about it, mate. Be prompt about it. Done. Hard work's done. Yeah. A1S, 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 A1S. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You see it, yeah? Yeah, I see it now. Yeah, no, 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 don't, don't, don't exit the hard one. Yeah. Exit two, stay in your lane. Yeah. 
And then the signaling left to come off. You're working with who? Uh, Barry. Larry. Larry. <laughs> Larry's the left, yeah? Right. L, left for Larry, right for Barry, yeah? Okay. Barry technically shouldn't be exiting, yeah? yeah? But we don't know. Maybe you'd be surprising us. We definitely got a few Larrys. Work together, yeah? Yeah. No, no, careful, careful. Don't force it, yeah? Yeah, okay. So just sort of, keep, keep, there's loads of spaces, does that oh, make I sense, see, yeah? I see, okay. Yeah, yeah. So you don't have to force, squeeze them in and like, like that. Right, you're naturally expected to get back into your normal yeah. driving lane, yeah? Good. That makes sense to you, yeah? Yeah, yeah. Cool. Cancel. Better gear, mate. Cool, you can skip gears as long as your conscience did that. Yeah, I'm, yeah. I'm assuming you did. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Right, we're gonna go right third exit, Mill Hill Broadway. Do you remember what, right, what we did? Exit. It was second exit, second lane. It was yeah, it was the middle lane. Middle. Yeah, second well, middle second lane, lane now because it's two now, right? Okay. So you wanna move into the right lane in good time. Just make it good time. Yeah. That's it. Fully fledged, go in. Cool. And then cancel for now. And then what lane was it? Um, middle lane. Good. Right. And your lane doesn't your your lane doesn't spiral outwardly, meaning your lane is the one that's gonna take you. Okay. It doesn't spiral outwardly. So you're gonna take do the MSM routine? Yeah. <coughs> so mirrors, you've done the mirrors with yeah. the signal. Yeah. Now the other way, mate. Break, yeah. break, break. If you slow it down, because you're coasting in all yeah, this yeah, now, yeah. break, break, break. If you slow it down, it's gonna make yourself feel comfortable and it gives yeah. you time to count. Have you counted? One. Yeah. Two. Yeah, one and two. Uh, that's three two, that's three, there. good. Right, now make sure you check your mirrors, yeah? And you're yeah. working with who? Uh, Larry. Larry. Mainly Larry. Barry shouldn't be exiting, yeah? Yep. You've got, you've got Maroon Larry on your left, yeah? And look, there's a big space, so yeah. technically you work together, yeah? You'd yeah. have to squeeze in any of the Larrys, yeah? There's a few Larrys on our left. Yeah. Now, we've still got to be mindful of the cheeky berries that shouldn't be. Yep. That right lane, the reason why we didn't pick it, because it, look, look at these, it's not appropriate, yeah, right? Yeah, you're, you're crossing over. That right lane is only for, 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 for vehicles to do a U-turn. Okay. Yeah, for do a U-turn. And it's, it's, it makes more sense when you see the exit, a sign for the other side. Yeah. Right, Mill Hill Broadway, yeah? Yeah. Cool. So what, what roundabout are we coming up to soonish? Um, <coughs> the double mini. No, no. It was a particular store. Oh, uh, the m &S Mini. Good. Cool, the Marks and Spencer Mini, yeah? Clutch down. Yeah. You see how the vehicles be appropriately stopped behind you, yeah? That's where you should stop, you shouldn't go any further, yeah? I see, okay. If you're the second car. Otherwise you'd be blocking the junction, yeah? Does that make sense? Yep. <coughs> right, so again, you need to accelerate hard around here, because yep. a lot of people are doing some sudden movements here. Yep. Mill Hill Broadway is a little bit busy. Your wipers increase the intimacy, mate. Right, coming up to a roundabout, mm -hmm. which we said is the MS Mini. Roundabout turning right. What was relevant about this roundabout? Um, don't swing left. Good, don't swing. <coughs> and that applies with other entrances as well, yeah? Yep. Yeah, you're gone, mate. Come on. Don't have to go too hard, just be progressive. Yeah. <coughs> what road is this? Uh, Colourful Road. Cool. It's all stitching together, yeah? Yeah, yeah. Right, when we get when we get back to the apex, this time we're going to take a different exit, mate, yeah? yeah? Technically, you did sort of kind of make the wrong choices in terms of lane picking. Yep. But your lane does go to the lane that you went to accidentally as well. Talk to it, yeah? Does that make sense? Yeah, yeah. But you just, I, I do want to go into that A1S yeah, lane, yeah? Yeah, yeah. So this time, we're not going to go right third exit. Andy, we're gonna to go towards Boreham Wood. Wood. Yeah, second exit straight on.
Well, now, here, this is Totris. Okay, so this Totris. is towards, right, exactly. Towards, towards the right second exit, sorry. Okay. Is this the double mini roundabout, not the apex? Yeah. Now, take opportunities to look at the signs as you approach. Okay. So our far right lane said A1S and TOTT on approach, yeah? Yep. So we're looking for A1N. N stands for? North. That's it. So we're going towards Borenwood and the north. So this one says north, A1. Yep. The second one says? Borenwood, A1. Same place, yeah? Yeah, okay. So, was it three lanes? Yeah, which lanes? Middle lane. Middle or left? Let's, let's go to the left because that's left most appropriate, yeah? Okay. Slow it down. Think about approaching it appropriately in the appropriate gear. Yep. You can see it says A1N and A41, left, you said left. Cancel, yep. yeah? Because that, that was the middle lane that you were yeah, trying to get yeah, into, okay. yeah? Sort your gears out in good time, mate. Now take your time. You can see a lane that you're going to go into, can you see? Um, it's the leftmost, yeah? Because left you're the leftmost lane now. Now it's just about being safe when entering, mate, yeah? yeah. Don't take them as cover yeah, or shields, yeah. yeah? No, 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 careful, mate. Go, but you're affecting no one, but that wasn't, that wasn't a right choice, yeah? Okay. Because you could have affected his speed, yeah? We don't know where he's exiting, okay. yeah? You're hugging the curb, mate. Hugging that curb, that curb, that curb. Otherwise, you just nearly went into the second yeah, lane, yeah? yeah? Okay. That would be a potential failing test, yeah? Okay. And the lane discipline, yeah? Did, that, did you see the mistake that you made, yeah? Yes. Cancel. Right, have a look at the cop, be conscious of the speeds. Good, get yourself going. So we're on Barnet Way, but we'd have to re remember this. We're coming up to another roundabout, it's a four exit roundabout, yeah? Okay. <coughs> I'm going to call it uh, uh, the Shell Roundabout, there's a Shell Petrol Station. Okay. We're going to go towards Barnet, it's the fourth exit. For now, do what you're doing, stay where you are. Naturally, when they're asking you to go right for things or right somewhere or wherever the roundabout, they'll start telling you about maybe three or four hundred yards before. Yeah? Okay. So that, that's your prompt to not consider moving lanes. Yeah? So they say, all right, in the next uh, 400 yards, 300 yards, uh, and then we're going to go right for the exit or right for the exit. Yeah? That's your prompt to indicate to you that you need to now move over. Okay. Does that make sense? So I'm going to try my best to give some such a prompt. Okay. And I think we should try to go gear four, gear five, mate. Yeah. Yeah. It's fifty, and it's a car sort of uh, yeah, keep making that noise, yeah, isn't it? Yeah. Be careful the curb, though. Yeah. <coughs> Don't make you nervous as an examiner that you yep. feel like you're going to hit side. Okay. So the roundabout's coming up in the next, let's just say, six hundred yards. I would like you to go right full things in. Do them one at a time. Okay. Just so it makes it look neater, yeah? Okay. So we're gonna go Barnet A411. A411. Yeah, right. Full things in. Barnet. Take an opportunity to look at the side. Yeah, okay. All about planning, yeah? yeah. You do spiral outwardly, yeah. Okay. So, have you signaled? Cool. Yeah, you're in a good okay. gear. Right, count. Take one. it slow. Don't accelerate. Don't accelerate. Don't accelerate. Don't accelerate. Count. One. one. Don't accelerate. Yep. Follow your lane. Follow your lane. Yeah. Two. It. Yeah. Don't accelerate. Don't accelerate. Two coming up. Two. Yeah. Don't accelerate. Because you got momentum. It's helping yeah. you a lot. Yeah. Three. Three. And then. Four. Yeah. Signal left. This is four, the one okay. that's coming up. You just counted the entrance, yeah? Okay. That wasn't a, that wasn't the fourth. This is the okay. fourth, yeah? Can you see it says bonnet on the sign, yeah? yeah Check your left door mirror if you want to squeeze in. Move away, move away. You're better off stopping, yeah? yeah, yeah. Rather than squeezing in, yeah? So you can see it, A411 yeah, yeah, on bonnet, yeah? Can you see the speed limit? The 40. Yeah, cool. 
nice new. That's it. Yeah. Get it going. So we're in Barnet Road at the moment. Okay. But again, it doesn't really matter what it's called. Let's just call it whatever. Yeah. Um, where I'm taking you is all relative for Hendon and Mill Hill, yeah? Okay. Um, you could go the other way around. Yeah. Okay. Um, it's like a cottagey area, very sort of narrow, windy roads. Yep. Obviously, it's 40 now. We can anticipate horse riders on this road. Yep. I've never, every, every time I come here, I've never seen a horse rider anyway. Okay. But, you know, it's telling us they can anticipate that. Yep. <clears throat> Even though it's 40, you can see at points you've got to naturally slow down, yeah? yeah of course. Because you can't really see what's going on. So, it's natural to slow down, and it's actually saying slow the floor at certain points anyway. Yep. When it's a solid white line, what does it mean? Can cross it. Good. Traffic lights coming up, I'm going to turn right. Now, I've got to make you... Turn right. Yeah, at the lights. There's a width restriction coming up. Yeah. Can't make me nervous, yeah? Yeah. If I touch your steering wheel, you fail yeah. in the test, mate, yeah? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <coughs> Okay. Yeah. If there's space behind him, at your turning point, which there is, you're good to go behind him. We're turning onto Hendon Wood Lane. Just follow suit because it's got red now, isn't it? Yeah? Yep. So we're committed for the whole thing, right? Take it slow, mate. Take it slow. Otherwise, it's going to make me nervous. Alright, so. So, I usually call this cottage road, yeah? Or yep. Cottage roads or cottages. But anyway, there's loads of little sort of villas and cottages on the left yep. hand side, yeah? It gets narrow. It's a 30 mile an hour road, yeah? Obviously at points like this, you're not gonna do 30, yeah? Yep. But eventually you're gonna get prog be progressive and get going, yeah? Yep. So, start going to gear three now for me. Don't have to accelerate hard. Yep. Just keep it sort of at three, slow it down where needed. Don't hit that curb, mate. Remember, oncoming cars can move away from you, yep. yeah? As much as it feels like a bit daunting and nerve wracking, Conscious of the curb. Big pothole there, mate. Yeah, just, you can see that pothole yep. coming up as well, yeah? So I think naturally you should have to slow down, yeah? Okay. I know it's a bit nerve wracking with oncoming cars, but don't accelerate to a bend. Okay. Yeah, don't accelerate to a bend, don't accelerate to what looks like holes on the floor. Okay. Yeah? So the mass, that was a massive hole there, yeah? Naturally saying to slow down because of the bend coming up. Yep. You can see it's a little bit challenging, isn't it? Yeah, yeah with oncoming yeah. cars coming in there. And it feels like sort of we're not in London, it's rural roads, isn't it? God, yeah. Yeah. As much as you feel nervous, mate, trust me, they can. I'm not saying go really over to them, but yep. be conscious of that curve because yep. at some times I feel like I'm at the edge of my seat. Fair. Especially as soon as they start getting close to each other, you can ease off the gas. That way you feel both feel a bit nervous. I mean, that's what I feel a bit better as yeah. an examiner. Yeah. Traffic lights, when we get the non accelerate, don't accelerate. Watch the curb, watch the curb. Yeah, watch the curb. If you're gonna accelerate, you gotta be confident that yeah. you're accelerating into that space. Yeah. Traffic lights turning right. Otherwise, I wouldn't accelerate the way you're accelerating, okay. yeah? Because you're accelerating to then get close to the curb because you're feeling obviously consciously and subconsciously nervous about that oncoming car. So, then therefore, don't accelerate like that. Does that make sense, yeah? yeah? Otherwise, you're shooting yourself in the leg. Yeah, fair. Because as soon as I touch that as an examiner, yeah, yeah, yeah. you're mate, you're gone. Yeah, yeah fair. Clutch down for now. When you get that amber, you got time, trust me, you got yeah. time. Bite, then gas, yeah? I know you'd be like, oh, it's a hill start, there's a car behind me. I know, it's all good. Just take your time with it, trust me. Good, good, good. You see, that gas yeah. helps so much, yeah, mate, yeah. yeah? It makes life so much easier. 
obviously we can, we're conscious to hear some sirens. We don't know where it's coming from. It might not be nearby. It might not even be like seeing it yet. But we'll be conscious to keep on listening out for it. Sure. It is 30, yeah? Sure. Okay, so don't go above. There's this little, there's this little funny bin coming up. He's got a picture of a policeman <laughs> holding a speed gun. I don't know if it's still there or not. We'll see if it is. It's like a famous bin. Two turns in two. I know yeah. it's a bit late for me yeah. in terms of direction. Slow it down. If you're not sure, you're better off stopping. Yeah. Be informative. Let people know what I'm trying to do. What are you trying to do? If you time it well enough, yeah. If you time it well enough. Don't accelerate down, accelerate yeah. down there. There's no point accessing down, that accelerate down the hill. Yeah. Literally gonna take the next right. You can see it coming up. It's right, yeah. Yeah. That's where the in between the bus stops, that's it. Yeah. yeah. Now this is where the, you can't really see oncoming cars, yeah? Yeah. You're very concerned about oncoming cars coming that way. Really take your time with this, take your time again, still take your time. Commit once committed. Are you finding the area now now that you've seen some of the hard parts? Um steep. Like yeah. The, the learning curve is steeper, yeah. Yeah. Do you think you will get comfortable by next session? Uh, yeah. Yeah. I'm just a, new, a bit more time in the area and yeah. just more practice on the quirky bits. Yeah. Now one thing that I think you can help yourself with is just making sure that you're not accelerating at certain points. Yeah. yeah? I think Sometimes it's just a case where I feel like you're not consciously accelerating, you're just doing it yeah. naturally. Where you yeah, feel yeah, like yeah. I'm just gonna accelerate now, be more conscious of where you're accelerating to, how yeah. much you accelerate, and it will help you deal with some of the quirky bits as well. Yeah, fair. Yeah, like here, they're blatantly telling you to slow down. Yeah, do you know what I mean? The bend's coming up, the brow coming up can't really see. Doesn't feel like we're in London at all, does it? No, not at all. Yeah. Slow it down now. Coming up to that um, the roundabout where, you know, I said um, you can only get the middle lane to go right third exit, yeah? yeah? So we're going to go second exit straight on. There's three lanes coming up. Okay. So no signal yet because we don't know what, where the lanes are, yeah? yeah? We're just going to go around the bend yet. Slow it down. Second exit straight on. Keyword is straight on. Okay. So, cool. so middle lane is good, as well as the left lane is also good, yeah? Yeah. Make a decision, mate. So there's three lanes here, can you see? So, uh, one, two. Yeah, so you got three. Lane, lane on the left, it... you, and there's actually lane on your right right now. I can't yeah, know if yeah. you can see it or not. Yeah. You're getting at the middle lane, yeah? So okay. obviously you pick the middle lane, right? Yep. Look over to your right, make sure you're clear. Look for a decent gap to go. Gotta be quick off the mark when they stop, yeah? Yep. You could use that handbrake to help you if you need to. Mm. It's up to you, mate. Yeah, that's it. Because you picked the middle lane initially, yeah? Yep. Otherwise that left lane went as well, isn't it, yeah? Who are you working with? Uh, Larry. Good. Should we signal left? 
Is this all making sense to you? Yeah. Yeah? yeah. We can still go in a bit more yeah. and then work, like, work around here exactly. That's it. Good. That's it. Cool stuff. Cool, cool, cool. Nice. Let, let's cancel. Slow it down a bit. Don't, don't accelerate excessively yeah. hard because yeah, you still yeah. want a two, four second gap in wet conditions, yeah? Yeah, yeah, of course. Yeah? Four second gap. Let's go see other bits of the area. Sure. That might be relevant and appropriate. going to be forceful, might as well be nice. So where are we going at this? Uh, Left at the right, yeah. Left, on the wrong side, mate. Don't accelerate, especially downhill, yep. especially to the junction. Bit of a risky one. Mm -hmm. It could be a scooter behind the bus, isn't it? Yeah. Okay. There could be something that is obscured by the bus, or that uh, that Porsche could have just accelerated yeah. and changed its mind the way it wants to go. Yeah. I wouldn't take those risks here. Okay. Uh, the way it accelerated to the zebra crossing, go on. even though it's clear, I just wouldn't do stuff like that. Right. Yeah. Coming up to uh, the Mill Hill Minis. This roundabout is going to be turning right. So down a touch, mate. Slow it down. Again, just as I said, that acceleration, if you, if you tone turn that right. down, yeah. Turn it right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. If you tone that down, it's going to help you a lot. Okay. So if you just look at his indicators, he's indicating. It's just the other one's not working, yeah? Not, not the silver car. Mm. A lot of acceleration gone wide there, yeah? Yes. Can you see how you're losing control, yeah? Yeah. That excessive acceleration that you're doing, you're already on the roundabout, so you're the king of the roundabout. Yeah. Technically, if you for eternity, if you just kept on going round, yeah. everyone needs to give you away. Yeah, so once you're on the roundabout, you don't need to, especially if there's nothing on your right hand side, fine. you don't have to accelerate hard at all, yeah? Fine. You see how overwhelmed you felt there, yeah? Yeah. Once you're on, you're, on, you're, you're the king. Just steady, progressively get going. Good. At points, yes, you would have to accelerate like that, because you might have just entered at the wrong time, yeah. and just to not affect the car on your right, you're sort of accelerating like that to get, get away with it. Yeah. Does that make sense? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right, Deansbrook Road, again, not relative to why it's called Deansbrook Road. Uh, it's called Deansbrook Road because it's Deansbrook Road, but we haven't given it a different label. Okay, fine. So we don't need to. Good, nice. It's pretty much like a meeting type road at certain points. Yeah. Buses do come down here. Pull up and pull off off this road. Yeah. She just hit the curb as she did that. Mm. Is that a fail? Yes. Yes. And that, again, you're accelerating. It's ambiguous yep. on the left-hand side. What are these people doing? Yeah. Right. You're not helping yourself again. Yeah. I don't know if it's because you feel like okay, it feels nice to accelerate, or whether you feel like ah, oh, I'm worried about oncoming cars. Or whether it's the cars behind you, but you're definitely not helping yourself at those okay. points, yeah? Because me as an examiner, you're showing me that you don't understand when to accelerate, yeah? Okay. Does that make sense? Like, I'm not saying you don't understand. I'm yeah. saying that, oh, why is this guy accelerating to the bloody zebra crossing? Fine. Does that make sense, yeah? Yeah. Especially if there's ambiguity, like we can't really clearly see on the left-hand okay. side. Do you get what I'm trying to say? Yeah. So just, again, just tone it down, mate. As an example, it will make me itchy with my itchy foot. I'm like, oh, yeah, yeah, slowing yeah. this guy down, man. Fine. I'm going to start bra braking for him. Like, 
here I'm feeling a bit touched and nervous with your speed and how close you are to that far car. Right, standard roundabout, we're going to go straight on, it's the second exit. Wrong signal, mate. So minor for incorrect signal initially, okay. yeah? Because you gave a right signal initially, didn't you? Yeah. It's downhill. Do we need to accelerate that much? Red car, point of concern. Okay. He thought about it. Yeah. We're going to go towards Queensbury. Queensbury. Okay. If I can't get a meter from my parked cars and oncoming cars, naturally you should slow down. Okay. As much as how confident you might feel with the spaces. Now, this right turn here, if we was turning right, I've had students either stop too far over and obstruct the oncoming cars coming from the opposite mm -hmm. way, and so not appropriately stop at their turning point, or I've had students turn without realizing that they've got to stop and give way to oncoming cars. Okay. Yeah? So they've either gone without stopping, because oncoming cars are yeah. private, right? Yeah, yeah. Or they've gone too far over and affected oncoming cars from carrying on going straight. Yeah. Technically, it's not a straight, it's like an awkward sort of staggered place. Anyway, be careful of the curb. Yep. You're good, it's your priority in general. But you can look at what the hell that blue yeah, car's waiting for. That's the perfect way to wait, yeah? Okay. That, blue, that navy car is doing good. Again, you're making me nervous, mate. Yeah. Okay. Again, you're not getting, you're not, you don't have a meter, but you're accelerating to that tight spaces. Yeah, I'm telling you now, you're gonna make your examiner nervous. Right. They can mark you down for adequate clearance, even if you didn't, even if they don't touch your steering wheel. Yeah. They can fail you for it because it's called adequate clearance, yeah, or clearance of obstruction. Okay. You just naturally need to slow it down. So I'm not going to call it an infamous width restriction, but this width restriction, I've had a student's fail. Okay. Do you feel like you can't slow down because you're going to affect the cars behind you? Is that why you don't slow down enough? Um, or do you just feel get a bit nervous with all the coming cars and you just feel like... Yeah, it's just kind of... Yeah, it's just pace, isn't it? Like, it's... I don't know, I'm just, maybe I'm just too used to being... Uh, comfortable, so you know, because I think that co your comfortability is making other people uncomfortable. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Does that make sense? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You've really got to zone in on it, man. Because we could be more fluid around here. This isn't Labra Grove, yeah? Yeah, this ain't start, stop, start, stop, start, stop. This is constant, constant move, 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 move. Yeah, does that make sense? Right, with restriction coming up. Okay. Now, if you hit mount, touch, scrape, pretty much fail. Fine. Think about how you're doing this, mate. Take it slow. Clutch 
just turned back to one. You should have gone to one initially, yeah? Fine, okay. Oh, Kevin, go slower, go slower. Yeah. Just about to press your foot brake there, yeah? yeah? yeah, yeah. See, if I was an examiner, I would have pressed your foot brake there as well, yeah? Fine. So, na naturally, the, 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 the appropriate thing to do would be stop, Fine. back to one, and do it at one. Okay. I just wanted to see what he was going to do rather than Fine. suggest what to do, yeah? Fine, yeah. But you can see why students have failed there, yeah? Understood, yeah. Bit of a cold. <coughs> you okay? I think my cough's coming back. Is it? Yeah. Definitely need to see a doctor. I'll no, accelerate to him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He, need, he needs that time. Yeah. You need that time as well. Yeah. I won't lie. That's the one thing I'm concerned about is your acceleration, man. It's too much. Okay, coming up to roundabout. It does spiral outwardly in general, the lanes. We're gonna go right fourth exit. So, so we're closest to the Stanmore area. <coughs> it's a busy roundabout. Yeah. Two lane on approach. It's the fourth exit that we want, right fourth, fourth exit. exit, yeah? Most of the hard work's done. Yep. Just focusing and staying in your lane. Yep. Staying in your lane. Is it spiraling? Yep. Count. One. Two. That's two. Two. Yeah. Three. Stay Three. in your lane. Stay in your lane. Yeah, it spirals out with you. Signal left. Signal so left. Uh, you just gone. I missed it. Yeah, you missed it. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. I think if you just again maintained okay. your speed, you would have been okay, Fine. yeah? It's just you're sort of not counting as well properly, so yeah. you're getting overwhelmed with everything, yeah? So, because that, that was your exit that we just passed. It's fine. I was okay. watching the floor and I couldn't find any markings. Yeah, that's fine. The markings were there, it's just a bit of fake. It's fine, yeah. yeah. When you look back at the video, you see fine, okay. what, what, was, what was the situation, yeah? Um, anyway, cool. Don't watch. Just keep on going. Okay. Less space, less speed, yeah? yeah. We'll end up doing that with restriction again, so we're getting another sure. opportunity at it, yeah? Sure, sure. The van, the van, the van, the van, the van, mate, come on. Ah, way too close, yeah? So I had to touch the steering wheel there, yeah? yeah? Again, you're getting distracted with oncoming cars too much that you're not worried about your own cars on your side, yeah? Okay. So that, again, like, that's what I'm worried about, the eventuality happening in the actual test. I understand. You don't have to go at that moment. You yeah. can wait, wait for a decent gap. It's a lot of acceleration, two bends, okay. yeah? Really not needed. But I can hear, I can just feel you accelerate harder at certain points. It's alright, anyway, um, just continue from the road straight on, come back to that width restriction, let's deal with that width restriction appropriately. Sure. One poor girl that I had, man, she was doing so well, she made me sit at the back of the test, 
which was fine. Mm-hmm. Um, and she's had this one examiner. Every time she gets him, always fails him. <laughs> right. And she was actually doing really well, man, uh, up until this point. So we're like technically five minutes away from Mill Hill Test Centre now. <coughs> and she does this with restriction. Yeah. And she slightly nudges it. Look at her right now. Right. And this is where he fails her. He could have been lenient, man. Such a horrible guy. Anyway, let's not get personal. Take your time. This side's a little bit easier, isn't it? Yeah. It looks a bit easier. It looks a bit sort of less challenging. Feels easier, right? Yeah. This side round? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I think what she didn't do is go back to one. She's like approaching it in two or something like that. And she didn't do herself any favours. You remember that junction I was talking about in terms of cars going straight on and turning right and stuff? Like when, when I mentioned Queensbury, okay. that junction's coming up again. Okay. Uh, we're going to go uh, straight on when we get there. You know, Sunday football is actually really fun to play. Yeah. When you, I think, like get consistently playing yeah, like yeah. a sport or something, and like you meet up every Sunday, it's like a like a ritual. It's nice, isn't it? Yeah, yeah it's, honestly, it's a good thing. I, I used to do with my friends. I, I don't get twisted. I'm not good like that yet. <laughs> but I used to do it with my friends, and uh, it was nice. The fact, like, yeah, we go play some Sunday football. Nice social. Aspect. Yeah, it's yeah. nice. It's a really good social aspect. It keeps you fit as well. Yeah, you know. You keep ties with your friends, you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. Right, I will be turning off the phone soon just to check sure. the traffic on the way back because we start thinking soon kind of need to start heading back. Yeah. Um, but other than that, overall, what's your what's your overall view of, t- of today and, and of the area? Uh, Anything that you can sort of self-criticize or take observation about the area where you feel like oh you know this Mohammed or that really sort of I need to focus yeah. on this or that in this area I'm struggling with like the, the unfamiliarity of it mm. so it's like I'm on edge but then like because you know I'm kind of focusing on the wrong things and then yeah getting distracted and not watching certain things I should be like, okay and... yeah so just like <coughs> we're in a new area and uncharted territories yeah, yeah? yeah. Yeah, so hopefully by again by uh, next session we should be genuinely comfortable enough yeah. for us to be uh, adequately okay to deal with the the test itself. Does that make sense? As long as you're being sensible, yeah. roads are roads, right? Yeah, yeah. Roads are roads, roundabouts are roundabouts, right? It's just being in the area and seeing it it gives us an advantage. Yeah. That well, oh, I've been down there with my home. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. Going towards Mill Hill, so we might as well do some independent driving, following the sides to Mill Hill. I think you should turn, actually reduce the lowest intimacy, that way we're not sort of screeching rubber yep. so much.
it's right, it's not really a road, yeah. Okay. You can see it's sort of staggered to the left, isn't it? I don't know yeah, if you can see it or not, yeah. yeah. This way some students just make some mistakes. <coughs> yeah, I can see that. Yeah, so take some opportunities watching this show me, tell me videos, especially the tell me answers. Mm. Um, I've also sent you a list of other videos to watch, yeah? Cool. Um, there's a bunch that I sent you. And it will help you get prepared for your test. Yep. I've had students wait here for all coming cars. <laughs> so they're not waiting, holding up cars behind. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah careful with this one. Yeah. And unfortunately failing because they're now holding up traffic traffic behind, yeah? The awareness and planning and stuff like that, yeah? Obviously yeah. when you're nervous you just end up doing things yeah. just that you don't think about. That's what the, yeah, 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 yeah. Signs we're following? Uh, Mill Hill. Okay. Mill Hill and uh, for uh, three head. Okay, cool. That handbrake will help you, yeah? yeah. It'll give you that moment that you need, yeah? Okay. That moment that you feel like I really need that moment now. <coughs> That hammer is that one. Sure, okay. Careful. Okay, bit too much acceleration there, okay. yeah? Rely on momentum a, more, a lot more as well, yeah? Okay. It's downhill, don't accelerate too much. Guy coming. Cool. I think we're good with other cars. Okay. Right, I'm going to stop this now.